And everyone, this is Alcow playing Vip Five. There's a castle up there. It's not Bowser's castle. It's Bowser's castle. I used to call it Castle Ju uh, Julius back in the day. Oh, there's Vip coins there. Final boss, Julius. Yeah, it's Castle Julius. That's how I've always called it. It's a villain in Final Fantasy Adventure. Phase One of Friends is shaking for more. Wow, really? Uh, Alright, I'm going to forget all of this, but uh, please read this out. Freeze on floor, freeze effect, Mega Man 7. Man, okay. Nah, this is a lot to take in, so look, let's just go through all the phases of the bot. Bowser's Castle, I expect I will do in multiple parts. Well, there's gonna be a cleanup, because like, it's the classic multi path. Fun time, good times. You gotta start with 99, 99, 99 times. See, see, you got door one here, you got door two here, you got door one and two here, goes door one and you got door two. I might end at a midpoint depending on how things go. And now it's some outside here, door one's door one, door two, door one's the tower, door two's the power. Uh, red chains mean good luck in Scandinavian novellas. But only if they can broadcast on public television. It's a very complicated social structure. I probably shouldn't speak with authority about it because I do not have any authority about it. At scale of man, it could have fell, but it didn't. And so I was okay. Remember to always wash your windows at all time forever. That is my requirement for Lent. Alright, look at that guy, spinning fire. Look at that, it says one again. We love the number one. Oh, you stopped firing fire, that's, that's neat, thanks. <laughs> See, now he restarted, but you know, he knew that I, I had passed safely over. He's a good guy, you know, he just wants everyone to enjoy themselves, and uh, I appreciate that enemy. Look at that, I scaled that tower. Like it was made of lard and blubber. So now we got that guy, and we got this man. Is there a fork, or is one and two always lead to these one and twos? I have no idea. Check it out. It's Tide Zone. Am I safe here? Let's not take a chance. No, I was not. Tide Zone. So there's no, like, real indication. Whether a place is safe for the tide or not, you just need to just kind of internalize where it's okay to be okay. Are you okay, old man? You seem pretty run down and a mouthed. A mouthism is a disease that affects like five old men out of seven. It's a very shoot. I got my head stuck in the block zone. Well, you know what? This is a prime opportunity to figure out if one and two fork or not. It's all done on purpose. So that we can have maximal, whoa, knowledge. Uh, rushing in here a little bit, huh, Rao Cow? <laughs> so two is Sponge Rock Farm with the falling saw blade. Oh, that kind of area. There's, like, coins just, like, up there? Oh. He just took a while to fall. Okay, we just got guys falling from everywhere. Nothing major. Don't need to call the cops or anything. Oh. Right. See, he, you can maybe, like, bounce on that guy, but you got a springboard. You should use it for springboard-like services. I need to do a little bit of this. Doesn't work out. You try to aim yourself with the sun. Doesn't work out. Yep. I saw that coin. Oh boy. Uh, that one is scary. Just wide on the ceiling. Whoa. And I got a one up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Da da. I heard the kick sound. This part, I, man, I am, hmm, that is a really, either it's a really tricky jump, or there's something I'm not seeing. But I lack the power to do anything about it. Ah, 
what really? <sighs> Man. See, that's the thing! Alright, so I made myself here big. Is that gonna change anything? It shouldn't have, but. No! What did I do when I did it? Okay, just one of those. Okay, there if you just jump straight up, you're gonna be mostly fine. I'm expecting something to be kicked down at me. There's no coins though. There, there's coins up there. But that's meant to help me out with this jump. Uh, that one doesn't extend, right? Uh, I, I need to look further up ahead before I just get in. How do you get that mushroom? Like, a mushroom spawns, but then just like gets absorbed by the block or something. It's pretty, it's pretty well done. Alright, so I have came- yeah, here. Where I- yeah, that thing... That thing's kinda scary. Ugh! No, why?! Mysterious b b b brip I don't know what your creator was thinking, but there sure is a brip brip brip. brip. All right, so here, yeah. Mysterious steak, terrible dinner. All right, here we go. Roof. <laughs> Roof. Roof. Go there. We go. Yeah, I know what, and that's fine, I'll take it. Oh boy, I can't wait to be trolled! So here there's a roof. It's good to know. Oh boy, here there's a whole lot happening. Alright, car up! Nope. Trolls though, like, I'm kinda expecting. Yeah, that was bad time. Like, I just, what, I, I didn't want to bop him, but he went right underneath me. That's cool. I guess I should have double backed and did some scrolling and stuff. Ah. Uh, uh, uh. Like, the mushroom, you cannot get that mushroom. Like, is the author aware of that? Why did he play his level? I can't tell if it's on purpose or not. Like, that's a wild thing to me. Alright. Watch out for roofs. I don't think being big is gonna be, like, me meaningful to anything. Boy, there's just so many things here you gotta time, man. I mistimed one of them. That luxury. So here, just like you gotta bop on just on this guy immediately. All right. Is it gonna be like an invisible block trap or something? Hey! It's different. Whoa, Alcal! Why are you reappearing here suddenly? And you're 
score and coins and lives are all different. So, as I was going to say, I'm going to save here to help out on cleanup. The problem... I'm just gonna even go ahead and destroy myself. The problem... I can't believe I did that. But I loaded save instead. And then I panicked and I turned off the emulator. With screwed up the very end of the recording, which that's embarrassing. Yeah, so I just replay that. Uh, you know what? I'm just gonna go through one. We're gonna go through one. I gotta save that too for cleanup, so I don't have to return there. Whatever. Ah, I'm so mad at myself. How can I do a mistake like that in 2019? Well, it's because it's 2019. That's why I'm not used to. Saving like that, but like, you know, at the start of- and yeah, I guess that's the thing. Like at the start and at the end of the video, it's always the same thing I do, but in the middle... Like that doesn't happen very often. The era of science... Has long been over. But anyway, I wanted to put a save there just because, you know, because I beat the level and I hate it. And, uh, you know, uh, when I do clean up, it's like, whatever. It's like, I'm still gonna be- Restarting from the start every time I die in the second layer. It's just that I do not see myself deciding, you know what? No, I'd rather restart from, from door two. Like, I don't know what are the door two fork offerings. I'll know about them later. Right, so last time I died here someplace. Oh, right, yeah, I had. I completely forgot what this level was about. How did I die? You know, some things are not important. Uh oh. Uh, some things are, such as not doing that. I'm so used to going stupid door too that I just stepped into student. No, I'm not, no, I'm not even dignifying you with my presence. I'm so used to it! I've been doing that for the last half hour. I think I'm probably wrong. I don't want to keep getting hurt by that jerk now. Roofs. I'm having trouble. Oh no, you can see the roof. Just barely. I'm like an idiot. There we go. Oh wow. Sweet. Way too early of a jump there, now, cow. You're the best. I'm gonna pop on this guy. But we're not high enough now, I guess we are. Man, yeah, when I got here, the first time I had, like, five, oh. What am I doing? What? That, that was such a huge panic move. Like, that made no sense. I am shook. I am playing super weird. Nonsense moves I'm making. Clumsiness is cleanliness. All right, you know what? Let's let's try the other door. See see how it goes. Me how see how it compares. See, I'm looking at this, and this looks to be even more of a despair country. Uh, so you're not safe on those yellows, but you can climb on up on those grays. Though. I'm just gonna give that guy a little bop, a little friendly bop. Yeah, this is safe. Lots of layers and lavas. I don't know, it's a weird trend I'm detecting. Alright, so... 
How does this work? Okay, so this goes down. Go down with it. Then you're here. And then you're with it. <laughs> Finally. <laughs> My dreams are coming true. I'm now with it. Hey, look at that! There's a guy sleeping up there, upside down. Never seen... Never seen such a thing like that. Am I smooshed? No, but it dreams that I am. Just, just as bad. By <laughs> some definition of some kind of word. This whole Bowser's castle feels kind of sloppy to me. In a weird way. Am, am I wrong? With these intuitions? This place is a lot easier than where I've been grinding it though. Wow! No, yeah, this is like easy town, button town, but it's not over. Hmm. Is this? Yeah. No. So I was wondering if it went backwards, but I don't think so. It just has like a very powerful current. Well, I got powerful fire, so. Uh, there might be a power up there or something, which... Like, there was that one door right- yeah, the gimmick here is there's, there's a powerful air current that's called water current. Water current of the air. Potatoes, I hate those. They're scary and they're mean. Well, uh... Yow. Yowie wowie. And the buns and burner, buddy. And those guys' hitboxes make no sense. So, alright, it's clear what path I'm taking. I think what I'm gonna do is that once I get to the split, I'm gonna put another temporary save there. In case... Because I'm gonna beat that. Like, basically what I'm doing is I want to see my cleanup as I play it. To avoid... Proximity mines. Alright, because I gotta play left at some point, so save, not load. <laughs> we'll lull you to sleep. I did it! I beat the section. Yeah, see, like, I think we're going at the end of that part to, like, control a current. So right now the current is going like steady buddy. It's not a real expression, it never will be. So uh yeah. So I wanna get as much of the money as I can. No, this is like just nightmare potatoes. Uh please don't nightmare my potato. I need it. Keep that. Alright. Uh, yep. <laughs> so I don't know, man, that thing is around. Like, should I be worried? Uh, oh, maybe the goal is that it, you get it. It's like, uh, oh, and you can swim with that, maybe? But yeah, like, seems to me like the goal is you want to... Yeah, now it's around, right? Oh, shoot. Well, I lost my flotation device, but I got a star to make, like, the return trip easier, and here's a mushroom, right? Yeah, now why would you have blue change on floor? This star lasts forever, by the way. Uh, at least it feels like it. Alright. Now, I did destroy a lot of enemies, but there you go. Then you go here, have fun, eat Pringles. Still not over? How many sections? Is this all still part of the same enchilada? Maybe. Welcome to Star Space! I can't run, apparently. At the very least, my, my walk speed has been severely reduced. Have a grand old time! Dinosaurs. We abuse them, and it makes for a funny show. Pterodactyls are not dinosaurs, but they are a prehistoric animal, so it makes okay sense. Man, that steak is on the other side of that grilled cheese. Like, why would I be afraid? I ain't afraid of no grilled cheese. Are you? You should be. It's made out of a turtle, and it's gonna look on the screen and say, That's a living! My name is Ridley. Alright, check it out. I'm gonna jump, get that thing. That's right, I did that. Ah, oh, shoot. I did that, too. Okay, it didn't despawn. It's just taking a while. I think the fire flower's still up there? Like, oh, maybe not anymore. You know what? 
This place is very slow and uncomfortable. Ugh! Okay. Seriously though, there is something very uncomfortable with what they did to the physics in general. Like, not just jumping physics, just the everything physics. I'm just gonna skip ahead here and regret it immediately. Yeah, no, that's some pretty powerful regret I'm harboring. Let's actually try not to do anything. What? By the bassoon. Okay, you're doing the exact same thing you did last time. This time, though, you. Ishir. Yeah. Yeah. Ishir. But that way, but that, 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 there was no. Ah! Solemnly swear. Alright, so from here, you're supposed to, like, jump here. Which is easier said than done, but I did it. Man, I might not even spring for the star then. Like, shouldn't I get a better power up instead? Oh, what? No, po. I've been spring for so long. Why is, why is it four in a row? Like, this is ASMT tier nonsense. Always in this state here, anyways. I'm always just normal, big, nothing in Flavor Town. That is my forever state of starting Starlight Rafter Power Power. Ugh. Just... Love being blind drop zone all the time. It's the best. Here, I keep forgetting where it's safe. Doesn't matter. Not in the slightest. Not gonna impress anyone here with fire flower. Like that's just a fact. That's just a fact of life. Yeah. It's all... Okay. Okay. Look. Hey. Look at that. I'm here now. Things are going. Fish. Why did I do that? What? In my little head of heads. What did I think was going to happen there exactly, I wonder, you know? Wow. That's a hard jump. Okay, here you give me a little thing to land on. That's nice. Line zone. But save zone. Okay, and uh, cross sun here. It's very Yeah, these interactions just happened. How about it? Wanda recital? Me and my mommy mo. I did it! There 
there's my save! But I mean, I've already been playing a while. Might as well do the clean up now! I don't know why I'm being so loud. Sorry about that. <laughs> so here's this part in Fort 1. I'm hoping that after one room, it returns to the incredible world of uh, Hapino Brunch. It's not a real place, though. So that would be pretty miraculous. Like, I'm hoping that just like the sewers and Starlight, Starbright, where the heck's my star tonight? Or like, you have to play those, and it's it's just a one room difference. Look, I'm allowed to hope. All right. Yeah, no, honestly, it's just a kind of a general bad idea to. Ooh, what am I doing? To just want to continue playing, but like, I don't know, man. Things are not as they seem. Oh, well, good show, old friend. You did it. You did it. Now, part of the club. Uh, -oh. uh, so the top here is gonna be safe, right? So, okay, this is a full-on generator. I had one of those in a while. Okay, a generator stop. <laughs> had its fun, but sometimes, you know, it returns. So, I want to jump, drop, and then go back in the bottom rung. Which is, uh, yeah, that's... There we go. Then we can be safe here again. Yeah! Oh, okay, not here. We can be safe somewhere. You're not safe anywhere in this nightmare zone. Slow down the plenty in the nightmare sea. That's a jump. Eh, did that jump. Do I want to keep this object of destruction? Yeah. Maybe it's not necessary. Everyone's getting destroyed themselves. There's a door! Yeah, that was a little bit of a nightmare. And it leads to its own parallel universe? Okay, since I'm doing cleanup... I put a safe stay there since I'm doing cleanup. I don't need to do the marathon again. I didn't expect this to continue into its own thing, though. Oh, shoot. Uh, yeah, go up, Laser. Go up, Superstar. Oh, now Laser's is going over there. All right, you can go over there. So wait, is all the rooms in Fork 2 going to be different? Like, completely different? That's scary to think about, isn't it? Guess we're gonna find out. This is a weird, kind of easy room, though. Like, it's... It's very hard to predict what your adventure is gonna be like in Casa del Bowser. It feels like... Like, just in terms of overall quality, difficulty, sandwich-making ability, bad decision-making, run... That's an eerie. There's two. That's a ghost. That's a mushroom that looks like an apple. Laser beam bouncing. It's quite affecting. No, it's not. Not in the slightest. The ghost turns to face where you from come, Blum. Did you hear? Oh, yeah. Yeah. I look like a box. Welcome to the Joe Corporate store. I'm spooked. Nelson. Of course, it's when I dig, I can make it. Ooh, you give me a cape, though. I mean, offensively, it's worthless. There's a lot of weird jumps going on in this neck of the woods. Like, this weird jump. Wasn't that a weird jump? Not in the slightest. It's a very normal jump, Mao Cow. Don't call everything weird. You're gonna, like, make the word mean nothing. Oh, there's a door. I died right at the end. Look at that. Never happened before. I don't get it. Still new. Still different. It's like, I am amazed at the amount of content in this thing. Like, are the forks in Fork 2 going to also be like that? I should have save-stated. 
at the start, because, you know, I forgot. <laughs> Technically speaking, it's, it's not too late yet, but... Okay. Look here. This level, you go all the way through the thing, through the fire and flames and... Fire and flames, aren't those the same thing? What's that song all about? Look at that, now you do it again with backwards. Wow. Never imagined such porridge flavor. Wow, that's a good move, El Cal. You're the best video gamesman the world is not yet ready for. Making decisions like silver pie. Like, it's nuts. Just as the decision itself is just silver pie. Is that a good decision? Is it a sin? I don't know. It's just said silver pie. Like, what does that even mean? I'm gonna die here and I'm gonna be sad. Yep, I'm sad. Integrate cleanup into the video itself, basically. Like, into the series itself. It's getting confusing, like, all the wants and don'ts and wants and flunks. And that's fair, I put just my marathon save there now, because now I don't have just a cheaty cake. that lets me do, like, just skip everything. I have to, like, watch things and play the game and, like, all that stuff that we try oh so hard in our daily lives not to do. Like, that's my job as a Let's Player, is that I play video games, you know, so you don't have to go out of your way, out of your busy daily schedule to play video games. Like, no one wants to do that, you know? We don't got time for that kind of nonsense. That's why you get someone else to play games for you. You can just enjoy them on the side, like, like you were meant to, like how they were designed. I think... It's an incredible system that society has devised. Ah, <laughs> oh, what a nightmare world we live in, don't we? Where we don't have time to play, so we get other people to play for us, and we just play vicariously. That's, uh, it don't got time to be there. So, we got to saw vicariously. That's, that's, that's just how things got so bad. In this land of ours, look at that, now the generator's behind me. So I don't really care. Like, that's just the reality of it, man. I'm sorry, buddy. Like, oh, look at that! If you press that, you get an easier way. Man! Next time! Fork 2? I'm expecting eight completely different levels. This is the standard that I was thrust upon here. <laughs>